have recently started using AI more and more in writing code in large code bases. And there is a lot of sentiment that AI cannot do this. And in this particular code base, it does struggle. I even joked recently that it's not wipe coding in using it, but it's grind coding because you're grinding <laughs> with it on a larger code base. And one common thing that happens is that it kind of overblows things. It does feel like some kind of a junior engineer whose code you need to clean up, which is maybe not the best experience. But there is one thing I noticed that I'm removing, and it's common, because at least Sonnet, Sonnet models do like to leave a lot of comments, some of which are kind of redundant, they feel redundant. And like when I code, I prefer not to write comments, because the comments lie. And comments lie because they are not a ground truth, the code itself is. So you can have a comment that describes what the function does, but function does something else. And the, the way it happens is that someone like code usually doesn't remain static. It changes. People write, rewrite, refactor. And as they do, sometimes they update the code, but they, but they didn't update the comment. This is why you usually prefer your code to be the ground truth it should be well written variable should be well named it should be easy to understand what it does this this is the best practice but now ai writes the code and it leaves comments and i'm starting to think that i'm gonna stop removing the comments why because if ai rewrites those things anyways that means that those comments are updated always and maybe they are truth now to some extent plus they maybe are helping ai in understanding the code base better but another thing is making it easier to for AI to test. One way that I'm playing with it is to make it log stuff. Make your application log control flow or something. Like what is happening and why is happening. Make it so that AI can run the application, read that log, and usually I even ask it this way. Read the code, tell me what it will log in this situation, and now run it through that situation and check the log and see if there are differences and where are the differences and fix them. So this is one of the things I sometimes use today to make a code base work better with AI so that AI could run it and verify it, not exactly like human would, but in a way that does work for AI in fast loops.